In this video, we're going to look at John Dagenkolb's giant Propel. The first thing that really struck me about this bike was the huge stem. He's running a 14 centimeter stem, which gives an overall reach of 60 centimeters. And that reach is really long when you consider that his saddle height is you know, average to low at 73.5 centimeters. Handlebars are Pro Vibe OS, and they're 42 centimeters wide, and they have a traditional bend. He's got a load of shifters as well. Another kind of interesting detail, he's got a top shifter, on the right hand for his thumb, so for when he's climbing or when he's battering over cobbles, I guess. And on the drops, he's got sprint shifters. So that gives a total of five shifters. Wow. The group set is Shimano Jura Ace DI2 throughout. The power meter is Pioneer, who last year only sponsored the Belkin team, but have expanded their sponsorship to include Giant Alperson. Another striking detail of Dagen Cobb's bike is the Fournier Mini V-Brakes. You don't see Mini V-Brakes very often on road bikes, but they look pretty cool and they feel pretty solid when we've just had a go on the bike there. Dagen Cole uses 53 39 chain rings, really standard fare, and an 11 through to 28 cassette at the back, which as teams have moved to 11 speed, they've added the extra sprocket at the top above their normal 25 tooth cassettes. Dagen Cole's bike is topped off by a pro turnix saddle with carbon fiber rails. I think this bike just looks really fast, There's something about it, I like it. And if you like it too, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and let us know which bike you'd like to see next in the comments below. To see more pro bikes, click there. And to learn how to ride the cobbles like a pro, click down there. Finally, subscribe to GCN. It's free and you get more bikes. Click on me.